Good evening, everyone. My name is Shasan Liu, and I'm an organizer with the Chinese Progressive Association. We're a grassroots social justice uh, group based out in San Francisco, and we organize working class and low-income Chinese immigrants around housing, uh, workers' rights, and health care issues. Um, I'm here tonight to share a little bit of my experience and our experience working with the data center on this wonderful new report we have out um, on Chinatown restaurant workers' health and working conditions. Um, and I'm, I was told I had 90 seconds, so I'm trying to stick to it. Um, data center came in uh, at a point when we had hundreds of pages of data and the task of writing a 30-page report after three years of grassroots research with restaurant workers in Chinatown. And they came in to guide us, support us, and co-write the report with us so we could have a document that could really synthesize all these years of work, the courage of the workers that came forward, and the truths that they had to tell. And without their guidance, there's no way we could have come up with, you know, taken all this stuff and put it together and made it, uh, you know, uh, concise and, you know, an eight-page executive summary and a 30-page full report. Um, this report really documents the reality that CPA has been organizing around um, over the past decade, um, looking at the conditions that working people are facing, and particularly in the Chinese immigrant community. Um, there is such desperation for jobs and for income that the, the work, the research we're doing is with workers who, in some cases, even after we've organized and won back wages for workers, they're afraid to come up to the office to collect their checks because they're afraid of retaliation and they're afraid of risking their future income. Um, that's the kind of reality that we're working to change. And so for me as an organizer, what was most rewarding about this entire process was being able to see um, and in September when we launched this report and went public, to have our worker leaders coming forward, overcoming all those kinds of fears of retaliation, to come forward, step up behind a mic, stand in front of a camera and say, this is my truth. It's the year 2010 and sweatshops still exist in this country. And something must be done about it, and something can be done about it. And that's what this report was about. Um, it's given the courage for our workers to come forward, and Data Center has been part of that process. It's a long path ahead to justice, but we are really proud and honored to share that path with the Data Center. So thank you.